What the hell is going on everybody? My name is Mehul and welcome to your part 4 I guess of Bootstrap tutorial not actually part 4 of Bootstrap tutorial but actually the part 4 of our kind of mini program series of creating an upload application and this is Bootstrap tutorial number 14 and in this tutorial I'll be finally finishing off or wrapping up with this application so be ready to get some assignment at the last of this tutorial I've planned something for you guys okay so now what we have to do is let me just check we need to just scale the images down a little bit and we can just make use of maximum width to avoid that and here you go nice and easy way to do that no fuzzing around okay so now that's the way to do a kind of you know um, image uploading service and what you can do even more is that when you click upload or sorry when you click submit you can just hide this model box by just saying that you want this to have a data dismiss of model alright and then obviously this is some dummy code because in um, real life example you would not obviously just close the model without making use of anything and I want this to have upload complete model in work alright so now we have to create exact same model and why spend your time when you have copy paste ready and I'm just gonna say upload finished and I'm just gonna say that your image has been successfully uploaded and saved to our server happy browsing and just get rid of all of that code and obviously you would like to have a checkbox right here and you can get those from bootstrap.com slash component check and I have no idea how to make use of these guys and I'm just gonna see how they are going they are making use so I'm just gonna copy this boy and here you go or why not just place this inside okay so let's try this out summit boom nothing happens embarrassing moment summit nothing happens alright upload summit nothing happens crazy little stuff and poor me because this is not upload complete crazy me anyways let's just sum it and as you can see it says your upload your image has been successfully uploaded and what was written after that I can't read because the model was closed so quickly anyway so that's how you create a simple upload application and your assignment is I want you guys to remove this code what I have created in this tutorial which says upload finished instead what I want you that whenever you click submit what happens is is a nice little table is formed in here a table with a row this sorry this column would contain the image a little small image this image in a little 
you know a compressed dimensions right here so this is your table and here is the image here is the name of the image you are going to upload and here are the two buttons which says upload the image or remove the image so this kinda creates a dynamic look and obviously if you have a lot of time to spare you can even go ahead and make this button a multiple check button so you can upload multiple files at once and do the same to them here and when you are done even with this then go ahead and create your backend code and when you are done even with that then go ahead and publish your website online and when you're done with that as well then go ahead and purchase Flickr so that's what I can suggest you guys and that's all for this tutorial and let's see what we'll be discussing in the next tutorial but it will be awesome so if you like this tutorial then don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching